there are some goodbyes that are harder than others, and they leave a lasting impact on our hearts. Saying goodbye to a familiar voice on the radio is one of them, especially when that voice has been a part of our daily lives. Recently, we learned that George Zafiu is leaving Europa FM, a station he has been synonymous with for years. After nearly 25 years, he's decided it's time for a new adventure, a new chapter in his life. George has been a constant presence on the airwaves for so long, his voice a comforting companion. Many of us can't imagine tuning in and not hearing his friendly voice, a voice that has become a staple in our routines. He's been with us through mornings, commutes, and everything in between, making each moment a bit brighter. It's safe to say that George has become more than just a radio host. He's become a cherished part of our lives. He's become a friend to his listeners, someone we could always count on. He shared his life with us, and we welcomed him into ours, creating a bond that will not be easily forgotten. While we're sad to see him go, we also know that change can be a good thing, bringing new opportunities and experiences. We wish George all the best in his future endeavours, knowing that he will excel wherever he goes. And we thank him for the years of laughter, music and companionship, memories that will stay with us forever. For the past 12 years, George has been the heart and soul of Deshdeptaria, bringing energy and passion to the airwaves every single morning. This morning show became a daily ritual for countless Romanians, a comforting presence in their daily routines. George, alongside Vlad Petrianu and Luca Pastia, had a knack for making mornings brighter. Their chemistry was undeniable, creating a dynamic that listeners eagerly tuned in for. Their banter was witty, their discussions engaging, and their laughter infectious, making every broadcast feel like a conversation with friends. They knew how to start the day on a positive note, setting the tone for a good day ahead. And they did it with a warmth and authenticity that resonated deeply with listeners creating a loyal fan base. George's contributions to Desteptaria went beyond just entertainment. He brought depth and substance to the show. He wasn't afraid to tackle important topics, addressing issues that mattered to the community. He engaged in meaningful conversations that mattered to his listeners, making them feel heard and understood. His ability to connect with people on a deeper level is a testament to his character and dedication. George is someone who genuinely cares about his audience and their well-being. And that compassion shone through in every broadcast, making a lasting impact on everyone who tuned in. So why is George leaving after all these years? Sometimes life takes unexpected turns. In George's case, he's ready for a change of pace. Waking up before dawn for so many years takes its toll. George has reached a point where he desires a different rhythm for his life. He wants to explore new avenues and embrace new opportunities. It's a decision that many of us can relate to. Life is about evolving, growing and seeking out fresh experiences. And that's exactly what George is doing. He's following his heart and pursuing his passions. Just because George is leaving radio doesn't mean he's disappearing from the public eye completely. He has some exciting plans for the future. And they all revolve around his love for music and connecting with people. One of his passions is organising music events. He recently launched Discoteca Party, a series that celebrates the iconic music of the 90s. These events are a testament to George's love for bringing people together through the power of music. George is also eager to support his friends in the business world. He's lending his expertise in communication to help them thrive. 
It's a natural progression for someone who has spent years mastering the art of connecting with an audience. Let's rewind the clock back to the year 2000. Europa FM was a brand new station and George Zafu was the very first voice that listeners heard. His words, this is Europa FM, it's 4 p.m. From this moment on, we are together. Life has changed, marked the beginning of an incredible journey. For the next 12 years, George hosted the afternoon show Europa Express. His infectious energy and passion for music made it an instant hit. He became synonymous with the station itself. During his tenure, George also served as Europa FM's music director. His keen ear for a good tune helped shape the station's musical identity. He introduced listeners to new artists and helped solidify Europa FM's reputation as a trendsetter in the Romanian music scene. One of the things that made George so special was his incredible sense of humour. He had this unique ability to make everyone around him laugh, no matter the situation. He had a way of finding the funny side of any situation, turning even the most mundane moments into something memorable. His laughter was contagious and it had a way of brightening even the dullest of days. People would tune in just to hear his infectious laugh and witty remarks. I remember one time when George was interviewing a very serious politician. The atmosphere was tense and everyone was on edge. The interview was going well, but it was a little bit dry. The politician was sticking to his talking points and it felt like just another routine interview. Suddenly, out of nowhere, George's microphone fell off his desk and landed right in his coffee cup. It was an unexpected and hilarious moment. The politician was mortified, unsure of how to react, but George just burst out laughing. His laughter filled the studio, breaking the tension instantly. He picked up the microphone, dripping with coffee, and said, Well, that's live radio for you. His quick wit turned the mishap into a memorable moment. The politician couldn't help but laugh along with him, and the interview instantly became much more relaxed and enjoyable. That was George's gift, his ability to turn any situation around with humour. He could make anyone feel comfortable, even in the most awkward of situations. His humour was a bridge that connected people, making them feel at ease. He had a way of disarming people with his humour and making them feel like they were just having a conversation with a friend. George's legacy of laughter is something that will be remembered by all who knew him. Section 7. Passing the mic. It's never easy to say goodbye to a legend, but all good things must eventually come to an end. As George embarks on this exciting new chapter, Alexandra Gavrila will be stepping into his shoes on Desteptarea. Alexandra is no stranger to the Europa FM family. She's been with the station for 10 years and boasts an impressive 17 years of experience in radio. She brings her own unique style and energy to the airwaves. It's a bittersweet transition, but we have no doubt that Alexandra will continue to uphold the high standards that George set for Deshteptaria. Section 8. A new dawn for Deshteptara. Change can be daunting, but it can also be incredibly exciting. While we'll miss hearing George's voice every morning, we're also eager to see what Alexandra Gavrila brings to Deshteptaria. She's a talented broadcaster with a passion for connecting with her audience.